It's the Saab Evo 20. And this is the first video on YouTube I'm making about this bike. What's the actual bike looks like and the components. It's even hard to find the actual pictures of this bike. I just did a eight miles ride on this bike here in Piermont, New York. <clears throat> and gotta tell you, it's a nice riding machine. It's uh, plush, surprisingly, even it's a rigid bike. It comes with a super smooth shifting transmission, which is Dior 3x10. And you can see it right there. It has a Dior hubs with a double alloy wheels. Uh, the rear light stays on, I'm not sure why. But as soon as you pedal in, the front light goes on and sometimes goes in the strobe mode. I'm not sure how to uh, connect that. I mean control. It has a Dior brakes with an order central lock Dior shifters and uh, another nice thing is that you have a gears that you can see same thing here a very comfortable grips very comfortable saddle uh, it's a commuter's bike and uh, one thing I noticed the tires if you see the white strip it's reflective so it's a very cool feature and this light is still stays on LED I'm not sure what's happening when you're riding maybe it goes in the show mode as well uh, I just picked up this bike here and uh, took it for a quick ride and this is what it looks like uh, size of the frame is extra large uh, I went with this size because of my road bike I ride the extra large road bike Scott CR120 and uh, well this one I should have went with a large it's still fine for me uh, the only thing I might put a shorter stem on it other than that nice pedals and you see Dior crank okay uh, this looks like reflective as well has a nice uh, this is a plastic uh, guard your chain guard uh, very surprised this is a very nice sleep build bike and the front hub is actually what generates the electricity for the light and I don't see no push buttons or anything for the lights I guess it's no way to control that that's it this is what it looks like and this is what I was talking about about the tires you can see that they do have a reflexive strip and reflects the light pretty nicely out of my camera it's a nice safety feature I was wrong the crank does not have a reflexive strip on it it's just the tires and also I did figure out the light you can turn it on and off the light with this uh, white button right there you just push on it and while you start pedaling the light will go on I haven't figured out the rear light you can see my rear light it still stays on so I haven't figured it out yet so it's a very nice riding bike I like it a lot I just took it for a quick ride around the neighborhood and rides very very well I'm very satisfied with it and I would definitely recommend for someone to buy this bike.